Hello. <sighs> Hello, everybody. How is everybody doing tonight? Happy Easter to those who celebrate. Happy uh, Ramadan for those who celebrate. And happy anniversary of Margaret Thatcher's death to everybody who celebrates. Hopefully you all are having a fantastic uh, day of festivities for all. Uh, today, we are going to get back to Elden Ring. Uh, Margaret Thatcher... The death of Margaret Thatcher. One of the most hated women in British history. If you're asking who, it's because your baby, your tiny little baby man, does not know world history. And Margaret Thatcher did a lot of uh, bad things. Uh, Origin, I don't know what that means, so I'm going to take it as a compliment, hopefully. <laughs> Thatcher's fucking dead. Yes. So, calls for celebration all around. Let me switch over. Yeah, so how's everybody doing this fine morning? Yeah, we didn't do any Elden Ring last week because I wanted to do some... I needed to grind out the Fate event. Uh, so I think it's, what, been two weeks now since we've done Elden Ring? So I would like to uh, get back to it. Last time we fought the ghost of God Godric. Godric the Galden. And whooped his ass. Sorry, hell take him used to go away now. So, kind of fuck ahead by a strong fever. I'm sorry. Here he is. Here's Eric. Needs blesses. Hey, appreciate it. Here's your Eric. I have up so blessed Ramadan. Hell yeah. I've updated my uh, my FGO support list, my main support list. I've removed Ku Alter and added Eric. And I add I on the raceshift.io, I've changed uh, Eric's uh, picture to be this Eric. Which actually, that's that's a this is a much better. That's this is a much better. Angle one sec while I print screen this. Got it. I'm totally not putting this in the super secret chat that only me and the mods know about. That was definitely not called admin feet pics at one point, but then had to be changed because Sam actually started sending pictures of his own feet and I didn't want to see them. True story. That, yeah, if you guys want to know some uh, some deep uh, lore to the, the the Discord server, the original name for the the admin chat in my server was called Admin Feet Picks as a joke. And then my friends were just like, what if it was actually real? Now go forth. Should I still be free balling? No. We're, we're, gonna, we're gonna get Eric some new pants, because he deserves them. I think these are still very... The Radon Greaves are very much in the spirit of Eric. Yeah, it's, it's better than bandages. And it gives me a heavy load. That's okay, I just gotta take off the axe. <laughs> uh, 
What's the death count at? I don't remember. I'm going to say 63. Uh, it's all your fault that I can't s say Gilgamesh anymore. Why not? What happened? What did I do? I mean, I'm sure that that's a good thing because fuck Gilgamesh, but what did I do this time? Oh, that's right. We are at 70. No. No, we're at 69. We're actually at 69 because I lived through the last one with the funny number. I remember that. Oh, Guru Gamesh. Where have you been hiding? I took you for dead. No matter. Lay out your arms then. Can I? I don't have a stone. stone. We, we're either at 69 or 70, because I remember funny number happened and everyone wanted that to happen. Uh, okay, so... I need to go here. And... I believe Millicent. I believe the last thing that we were trying to do was Millicent's quest. And Millicent is like around here. No. Hold up. I pull I pulled up a thing for this. Oh, that's why I can't see it. I don't have the fucking waypoint for it. She's, like, in this area. Actually, let's go here. Let's just say funny number. Yeah, that's fine with me. It means less death counts for me. I finally have a tire. Hell yeah. This much? Okay, I did. I about walked backwards and died for it. Uh, the news on NA, you mean that we are getting the Lost Belt 6 in June? And that we're getting the new the Crane event in a week, give or take? I saw that Twitter was upset that they called it a planet is born instead of a star is born. What meanwhile... The two words, as they've been in every single thing in Fate, have been misconstrued in that exact way. So why they're having a fucking piss fit about it right now, again, when it's a consistent thing that they've done, is beyond me. But yeah, you know, let, tw let, let Twitter be upset for discovering something that's been happening for 20 fucking years. Good for them. They, they can live in their... They can live in their own hatred. Millicent should be around here. I mean, what I probably need to do is just actually, like, follow this and just go do Volcano Manor. I hate doing Volcano Manor. It's not hard. It's just... So much running around. Why did why did they think it's because the the okay the proper translation for a lot of for that normally is I believe they use the word sekai which means world right I'm pretty sure that it's it's either they use sekai which means world or a word that means world for the translation but uh. FGO, or not FGO, but Fate in general, ten, has a tendency to use the word star in their translations instead of world. When the actual Japanese is... When the actual Japanese is in... Uh, it, it means world, or planet. But white, white folk on Twitter want to you know, suddenly make it an issue when it's not been an issue before. Annoying and unnecessary? What is? Twitter? Yes. Like, uh, if you want a good example of that, um, 
Artoria's Bonsi, I believe, is called the Crown of the Planet, or it's either called the Crown of Star. I think it's called the Crown of Stars. But then, if you directly translate it from Japanese, the actual name it's it's Crown of the Stars, not the Crown of the Planet. No, Star is Hoshi. Hanabi is fireworks. Millicent should be around. Or no, oh, okay, she's over that away. Yeah, Hanabi, Hanabi means fireworks. Hoshi is star. Now, there should be something here, because this is a ruin. I guess I'm dumb and don't see it. Just a quick, more another once over. This is not really what I'm planning on doing, but you know, already went up this way. There wasn't anything here. You mean ultra? Yeah, ex yeah. Exactly. People like wanna. People wanna just like bitch about translational era errors, because they wanna find anything to be upset at fate for, because, you know, Twitter. I don't know. Oh, there she is. Ah, in truth, it's been smooth. Scarlet Rot has stilled, since as such, I've been able to continue my journey. Though I realized that if I still had my sword, I could have aided you. Here, take this. this arm. Take this arm. I am in your debt yet again. I think if the arm serves well, it might be possible for me to wield a... If the arm... It might be perhaps that... Sick. Yes, Hanabi means fire flower. Japan is incredibly literal with a lot of their... Uh, a lot of their translate, well, not translations, but their words. For example, uh, the word for volcano is kazen, which is just which just means uh, fire mountain. All right, this guy, he's got guys that shoot lasers. Where'd he go? Where, 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 where are you? I hear him over this way. Bastard. Come here. Uh, Ka Kazan. Yes, Kazan. Sorry. Oh, I learned what this does. This just uh, increases damage to everything that's in the area. Thanks. Thanks for that. Don't blow that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Why would you do that? Ow. Do it again? You can do it again. These guys fucking suck at fighting, by the way. Yeah! If I remember right, there is something cool in this area. It's not this guy. Imagine dying with that hat on. Hi. Oh, oh, you have a gun. Oh, he's got the blicky. Can't 
can't blame them uh, because the moment a star is born sounds cooler, but I don't know the story of Lost Belt 6 or Lost Belt in general, so I can't... I mean... I don't know. My big issue is that it's an issue in translation that's been occurring for literally the entire existence of Fate coming to the West. So having people still bitch about it is a little bit frustrating to see. It's just like, who, realistically, who gives a shit? Does the story at large change? Ew. Because the title is slightly different? I, I mean, I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I don't know the story of Lost Belt 6. I mean, I kind of do. And from what I know, I would think that a planet is born makes just as much sense, if not more, than a star is born. But I don't know the full story, so I can't say one way or another. No, the, the, the Tibia Mariners are not. They're incredibly easy to fight. I think I need to bump my decks up next. I think that the only reason I'm able to hold this damn... Axe. Human bone shards. Uh, horse, get me up here. Bitch. That's with Eric. Alright, me go bed. Now right, you have a good night, man. Thanks for hanging out. Get a good sleep. Alright, where's the entrance to this dungeon? No, it's around. It's either around here or it's up. It might be up. It's looking like it might be up. It's up. Oh, it's uh. Stone sword key place. I don't think I have any. Motherfucker! How dare you! Uh, I remember laughing at my cousin when we read her pen pals letter. She called her brother Chase Yozara, which means night sky. It's ironic since Catherine is hot-headed, hence Hana BAK fireworks while Chase is calm and lazy. Interesting. I don't have the thing to get in here. Cool. Oh, there's a thing here. Oh wait, I think I know what this thing is. I had a thought. Surprising, I know, but I did, in fact, have a thought uh, earlier today. Wind is fucking weird, isn't it? You ever, you guys ever thought about that, how wind is weird? Like, I want you to think about it. How there is... If you came down from, like, a planet where wind didn't exist, and you just, like, saw shit flying around, like, trees and stuff just moving around, that would be the scariest shit on the planet, wouldn't it? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Mother... Fuck you. It's 
not this one. Imagine turnarounds. Yeah, like, just imagine. Like, you have no contact. You are the worst enemies in every Souls game that isn't a dog. Fuck you guys. You're not gonna bleed me. I'm the Blood Axe. gimmick with this dungeon. Something's up. I don't remember what it is, though. I think I don't want to stand on that. There's, like, a big guy around this corner or something. Yep. It's an omen killer. These guys give you Scarlet Rod if they grab you just like that, right? Okay, not these guys. One keeping. Yeah. I will single-handedly remind the world that Eric Blood Axe exists in Fake Grand Order. If that is my reputation, then so be it. Worst reputations to be. If All Muscle's gonna remind people that Geronimo exists, then it's my moral duty to remind people that Eric does. Oh, he's not a Nomad Hunter, it's just a, this guy. Uh oh. Yo! Bitch. You ain't got fucking shit for poise. I can do this all day. Tornado. Okay, tornadoes makes more sense than turnarounds. I didn't know what that was. I was really just gonna run with it for you. Men seeing people, things like buildings and cows flying. You don't know what's going on because of the way exactly. Yo! I know there's more of you. It's never just one. Spikes? Oh, there's spikes up there. Now look what you fucking did. You still ain't got no poise, bitch. I ain't got no stamina, but I don't need it. Oh, I need it. I missed! Some greaves I'm not wearing. Hello. Done two dungeons in the starter area? Good. Very fun game. I highly recommend continuing to play it. work our way back. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I just looked out the window in the middle of work. 
and the trees were fucking going wild. And I just got to thinking. Imagine if you had no idea what was happening and you just looked outside and you saw all that. You'd probably lose your goddamn mind. Like, what is happening? What is that? It's not this dungeon. There's a dungeon where those things, this thing's falling and you have to, like, ride on top of it to get to something. I just don't remember which one. Is this... Well, fuck me. So, question for all of you, Fate players. Uh, who all are you currently saving for that's coming to N.A.? Aside from the obvious ones, like Morgan and Oberon. Uh, Oberon, fair enough. Do kittens have a sense of self-preservation for themselves? Probably. I don't know why nature would say no. You already know? Yeah. Fair. No one for this year, really. No love for uh, this year's anniversary. I summon Eric Bloodaxe. Ass looking cat. Yo. Let's go, Eric. Yes, I am very far past Godric. Love Wart Picker's belt. Oh, okay. Yeah, we are mid game right now. We're pretty deep in. Okay. That was fun. Uh, okay. Oh, that's for I I forgot I forget about the the summer servants we're getting this year, huh? Getting some pretty nice ones. Does this kill me? Hadn't fucking better. No? Okay. Uh oh. Come here. Don't you disappear on me. Nice. Hydration? You got it. One to my side. Go and see it up the yonder. Uh, I'm looking forward to the fight in this area, though I don't think I can actually complete the Volcano Manor stuff until I've unlocked the mountaintop of the giants. I'm pretty sure the last thing I need to do.
pretty sure the last hunting mission is in the mountaintops. That's okay. This means we have to go through, ow, go through Gold Town. Ow. Why are you going to come in here and tell me you've pirated a game? Don't do that. What the hell's the matter with you? Go buy that game. That's an amazing game by an indie company. Those fuckers deserve the money. It's not a AAA company that's scalping you for the price of like 70 bucks or anything. The Darkest Dungeon's $15. Go pay for that shit. That's a, that game is too good to pirate. You can, it is morally correct to pirate Ubisoft games. It's never morally correct to pirate indie games. That's a, that, that is a Pledge Radio official stance. Oh, what, okay, I don't remember what's in this place, but we can go check it out. Yeah, go buy the game. And if you're a horny bastard, go da go like find all the Shindol mods that exist for I think every character, and use those. You see, I would say that's fine. The issue is that you then the issue is then you're playing Assassin's Creed, which is already not great. Maybe I don't want to be here. Maybe I should have found like a bonfire first. Cause I know there's one like it's not that far off. Can I just open this. Going here. The condition does not justify the means. If you were stealing food because you were hungry and had no job, that'd be one thing. I don't even remember what this thing does. Fire attack, lowers damage, negation, don't care. Reduce damage and impact, head, don't care. Uh, raise attack power when HP is at max. Interesting. Never going to use that. Okay, yeah, the thing here is... That's just an item I'm never going to use, and I'm going to run away from this big fat man. Or am I? Don't turn around. You. Ow. Was a motherfucker, you know that? Yo, Pirelati's hammer. Pirelati. Fuck you. You're gonna get stun locked and you're gonna fucking like it. Uh, all right. Now for the... I didn't mean to drink two. That's fine, probably. Now for the thing I don't like. I don't know if I take this fight. Try it. Oh, he has a lot of fucking health. Uh, to answer the question, no, we don't take this fight.
How do you expect me to buy a game with no money when I just wanted to play the game first to see if I wanted to pay for that game or not? Because that logic doesn't stay, doesn't work when the reason why you're doing it is because you don't have a job. Instead of saying, I bought it so that I could test it out, you started with, I don't have a job so I can't afford it, so I pirated the game with a kappa face, as if we were going to high-five you for doing that. That's not, that's not a chill thing to do. Also, I think I'm going the wrong way. Isn't there, I was gonna say, isn't there a grace, like, right here? Yes, is the answer. And there's a boss fight up here with a big bitch with a stick. I'll be honest with you, I ain't worried about the little dudes. It's the bitch with a stick I'm worried about. She's right here. So here's what we're actually gonna do, is not fight her, and get the grace that's right here. Pro tips with Glitch. Knowledge, stay stupid. But the game did not like that. No, let me hit the bitch. wizard. Darkest Dungeon's also having, uh, it's, uh, it's sequel is coming out soon. I don't know how soon, but soon. Uh, also, if you didn't know, this is where you get the best spell in the whole fucking game. Try sorcery. There it is. Common Azure. That's how you. That's how you do the thing. Is it out? I, I think the. I think like the. The Watchuma who's it. The early access has been out for a little while, but I don't. I didn't think that the actual game was out yet. Because when that comes out, I'll play it. I. Oh, I fucking love Darkest Dungeon. I'll say this, Tig. Uh, you should probably honestly buy both of those games. Uh, the first and the second one, because they're not the same game. The second one, it, the first one's like a party-based, where you just like keep cycling new people in and out. The second one is more roguelite, where it's just, you put your team together, and then you go around. You put your team together, and then you just like, essentially try and survive for as long as you can. Unless that's changed. That's how it was in the early access, and I imagine that's how they're sticking with it. So it, you'll get two different game experiences from it. And plus, people have mods for Darkest Dungeon 1 out the ass, so I highly recommend that.
Uh, I personally like... Uh, that's hard. I like the Plague Doctor a lot. Plague Doctor's really fun. I really like the Leper. The Leper's design is phenomenal. Uh... Hmm. I like the Highwayman's kit the most, I think. I don't much care for the Arbalist. I think she's fine. Uh, the Spear Girl. I don't I don't remember what she is because she was DLC, but she's okay. She's really fun to use. Her kit's interesting with all like the snake stuff. You're a good man. Shield Breaker, that's what she's called. She's cool. I gotta say it her like side thing. Uh, where you have to... Her side thing where you have to, um... Thank you, game. Like, fight the vipers in her dreams and stuff. I'm not the biggest fan of that. Just because it's... It always happens at the worst times. And fucks you over. It's cool. It's thematically cool. Flagellant is fucking awesome. Flagellant's cool. Maybe once I'm done with Elden Ring, I'll do some Darkest Dungeon. I, I, lo I love Darkest Dungeon. I'll, I'll be honest with you, I've never beaten Darkest Dungeon. Despite my love for it, I've never beaten that game. Just because it's so fucking hard at the end. But, like, I'm pretty sure I've played it for over 100 hours. The game is absolutely phenomenal. Oh, oh shit! Shit! Fuck, it bought the bundle with all the DLC. Uh, let me, if you've never played that game before, do yourself a favor, do not enable the blood DLC. Or, like, don't enable the Crimson Court shit, because that shit is fucking crazy. You can if you want to, but it, it just adds a whole other level of, like, nonsense to that game. That, if you're just learning, might be a little bit, uh... Might be a little bit rough around the edges. Jester's cool. Jester's really fun. Let's help this guy out. Day is saved. Jester, I believe, up until they patched it to nerf him a while ago, did the most damage in the entire game with his finale move. Uh, also, Tig, and anyone else for that matter who's uh, going to be just starting out with Darkest Dungeon, there is no shame in playing on Radiant, which is the quote-unquote easy mode, because even that is hard as fuck. That one essentially just, like, gives you the out where all of your people aren't going to immediately die, and then you soft lock yourself and lose. I'm just saying that for, like, to play around. Do, do like, some test runs with that, and then if you want to go and, like, do other shit after that. No pain, no gain. Alright, no, I'm, I'm just giving you veteran advice. Darkest Dungeon is so fun. I've, I've not played that game in a long time. I'm a Souls player, yeah. 
The game will kick you while you're down and shoot you afterwards. The, no, it absolutely will. It'll start. The game will start you off with two characters. Uh, I think that it's always that you get uh, the knight who's a kleptomaniac, who, so he just steals shit from you. Uh, and then I think that the... What's wrong with the... There's something wrong with the... Uh, the highwayman that you get to. I don't remember what, though. Oh, fucking... It's a crazy guy with a spear. Don't kill me. I need to find some fucking churches and level up my flask, because this is not good. I heal for piss when I drink. Reynolds and Dismas. Known cheat in, is his net. Okay, known cheat. Yeah, so he can't be in the gambling house. I think that this is the first time ever in Elden Ring that I've made it to this part of the game without, like, getting completely lost. When I was first exploring this area, way back when Elden Ring first came, back, came out, Sam, or Panda, had, like, blitzed through the game and made it here. It took him five hours to help me, like, get here. I said, ask him, where do I go? He's like, oh, just go this way. And he was just, he was just lying to me. The whole time, he was just fucking, like, lying to me about where shit was. Like, oh, yeah, just, just go that way. You'll be fine. I'm not fighting this thing. We'll come back and deal with this guy. Bye. Fuck you. I give you that. Ow. Ow. Thank you. I just remember getting so lost once I hit the capital. Yeah. Yeah. The the first experience of the Altus Plateau is kind of rough because it's just like I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Oh dear God! No, grab, grab the, grab the, grab the, grab the, grab the, grab, 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 grab the. Wait, that grace. Manor is right there. No? No. Why can I summon somebody here? What boss is here that I don't know? I know it drops good stuff. I think he also I think these guys also drop seeds. But uh, I hate fighting these things. This one's not rotted. Bitch! Titties! Uh-oh, uh -oh, back up, back up, back up. Never get near anything that glows in these games. If it's glowing, it's gonna kill your ass. Wow, 
Why is this not connecting? I'm literally inside of it. No, leave Eric alone. see your teeth. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, we're fine. Uh. Alright, cool. Well, that's pretty neat. Minor Erd Tree. Is there anything here for me? No. Anything around the back? Yes. Golden arrows, okay. Uh tree spirits give seeds? Was that not was that not a tree spirit? No, you're right. Yeah, you're right. There's this thing over there. Grease. I'm not fighting you guys. I think I just fucked myself. This is not where I want to be. No, this is not where to- Oh, wait, hold on. You need to die because you're about to make this fight a pain in the ass. Is there more dogs? I feel like there's more dogs. Come here, Anastasia. Ow. Ow. Okay, bitch. Oh! Oh! Dumbass. That's an axe. Golden Vow. Okay. Uh, this is not... We need to be up there. This Volcano Manor is over here. So I think... Is it this one? This whole area is confusing. No, it's not this one. You know what? Let, let, let's go give it the old college try and fight this thing. Uh, I have enough souls to level up, so I probably should have done that, but, you know. I need him now standing still. Why the fuck was he levitating there? Will you stop? Oh, lord, no, this is a bad idea. This is a very bad idea. This is an incredibly bad idea. I think that these guys, I'm pretty sure, once you break their outer shell, they take more damage. So I have to do heavy attacks on them. I'm pretty sure that's how this fight works. this. Let me get to his eye. No, you stupid game! Uh-oh. You bitch. No, you do not fight this guy on the horse.
70. Here's the thing. I'm gonna probably like put these on my VOD channel that I never update. Just like all of the all of these fights. Where's my not these fights, but all these streams. Where's my souls? And the, the people in those comments can mold about how I don't know how to count. Uh, on the... So what I'm gonna go do is not fuck with this guy, because he's just living his... I'm so fucking stupid and I hate myself. Walk right by the big fucking manor. I actually did damage, Jesus. You say someone added to the death count, but I've only died twice this stream. We've been going for an hour. I'm gonna say, pretty good. Shot me right in my Achilles heel, Jesus. You having fun yet? Yeah, I love this game. I have a confession for you guys. The boss of this area is one of the most beloved bosses, like, in... Elden Ring, Rikard. I think Rikard's design is cool. I think his fight is boring as shit. I think he's cool. His fight fucking sucks. Together. Are you precocious? Yes. We're fascinating. And not unlike another guest we had long ago. Uh-huh. So tarnished have you ever harbored doubts yes about the burden of grace and the dogmatic ramblings of the fingers they don't talk if you have why not join the volcano manor and fight with us right your decision is most welcome yeah now you belong to the volcano manor family the drawing room lies down the hall make yourself comfortable i am tanith the proprietress of this house uh-huh an honor to have you. Cool. Am um, I excited for Grail Live? Yes. We are getting an Ushi update with that, an Ushi costume update, so of course I'm excited. Yes, we have come to kill a snake. And this guy, I guess. Dumbass. Oh, don't you feel bad killing your fellow tarnished? It's like, I've killed so much worse. Hidden path. There is. There is a questline I would like to do. Thank you. Oh yeah, the ambient music of this area is awesome. Recusant finger. Is that is that my wife? A pleasure to meet you, brave tarnished. Behold. I am Raya, the scout. 
very pleased to welcome you to the volcano. Behold, Mother pretty lady. And lady Tanith's guidance. May you tread the path of valor. I love this character. This is this is a good character. Brave Tan under Lady. Who are you? And what in heaven's name are you doing here? The volcano manor is a pit of riches. I hope you understand the Well, as long as you understand what you're saying. I got you, dude. The path you walk is blasphemy. Before you consider hunting any of your own. Did you know that you can't get this guy's armor ever? Is it is it just a snake? Yes. This blast before you can see. Fuck you, shit. Uh, let me open that door. Uh, Resident Evil last cutscene. Okay. Uh, inventory. Old Knight Eastvan. Found in Limgrave. Find the red mark on your map. If you have the exact location, you got it. Let's go kill an old man. As is the want of Eric Bloodaxe. Alright. He's in the Arena District, if I remember right. He's over here. Yep, he's right here. Closest bonfire I have is the Storm Hill Shack. Let's go. Mm. All right, question. I just got Raiko. Can someone tell me, is she better than Kentoki Zerker and Heracles? The answer on both of those accounts is no. Uh, mind you, that is two single target berserkers versus an AoE berserker. They fulfill different niches. So I would say, uh, once Konya and Skaya and Oberon come out. Raiko becomes much better of a, of a unit. Once, like, Buster Farming supports come out, you can use them to make uh, Raiko work more. Right now, she's just kind of in this weird niche where she's a... Uh... Oh, you're on JP? Oh, okay, then yeah. Uh, she's not bad. She's workable, but she's not She's not as good as Kentoki and Herc. Herc? Herc. Because those two are just buster beat sticks that you go in, you do the thing that you need to with them, and then they're done. My question is, what did you guys think of the Salem video? Thoughts on Salem? Any glaring issues? Gravity. You got moves. Fuck. That does a lot of damage, doesn't it? That. How did that miss?
Okay, we're good. Haven't gotten a chance yet. Uh, I haven't watched it, but I'm going to watch it later. I'm back what I miss. Nothing much. We made it to Volcano Manor. We're doing the Volcano Manor stuff. Uh, no, I will never kill Patches in this game. Or any game. Patches is one of my favorite Souls characters. I will, ne I, will I refuse to kill him. Thought Patches did early on. No. You have the opportunity to kill Patches, but... You can say no. Did you read the letter? Left? That is the time. You will be compensated if you are loath, but you must leave this. Ma'am, I don't think you understand why I'm here. Have no place for them. You have complied. I am pleased. Now you are a recusant true, and a full-fledged member of the Volcano Manor. What the question? I didn't ask any questions in that video. Promised. I uh... never forget. That the, the way it is the true path to valor. I mean, I kind of talked about it on stream a couple of now days ago. That Salem as a chapter. Did I not? Oh, I can't. Salem as a chapter is really good, but it's held back horrifically by the fact that it is in FGO and not like its own thing. Have he any strange something beyond the walls? Oh, fie, what am I saying? It just is impossible. I must be tired. I love this girl. That girl is wife material. I know there's a hidden path in this place somewhere. I remember this guy. I think this guy uses magic or he's a bleed guy. It's one or the other. Don't you have to smack the wall for it? You can't swing your weapon, I don't think. No, best girl is 100% Ronnie. I'm a big I'm a big fan of Ronnie. I might, I might just need to progress further in the Volcano Manor stuff before they let me go and do that. That's probably it, honestly. Uh, the breakable wall wasn't patched. The breakable wall... Well, maybe it was patched, but th that whole thing, though, was like you had to do, I think, nine... Like, what, almost a million damage to it for it to work? This, this fight sucks. Yeah, you are thinking of a different wall. That wall is, like, behind the dude who's just like, Well, ain't you a piece of shit? Oh, that's right. You have the bow, and you are a bastard. It's a rogue. I don't want to have my wondrous physique on. No, please jump. Yeah, okay, me too. not liking this guy, but I think you do get his dagger, which is kind of neat. Bitch. 
Ja, da, 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 da. Hey, what's up, champ? It's Robin Hood. <laughs> Battle of the Low Rarities. This one's mine, dude. Supress Vile. What the fuck is that? Is it an item craft? No, that's probably a key item or something. Let me see. It's a talisman. Let me all sound made by the Ooh, interesting. Uh yes, clutch it Cludge will usually autocorrect to Cludge. Cludge, I believe, is a type of drum. No relation. Or if you look up Klidge on, uh, I guess that there's a ship for something called Klidge. I don't know what it is, but you'll find like fan I art of like two bolt of like two guys snuggled up reward. against each other. If you look up Klidge now, on Google, perhaps the time has come to tell you of the true ruler of this manor, Lord Rikard. Yeah. The Erd Tree blessed the tarnished with grace, but it was all too meager. In the face of the enormity of their task, the tarnished were fought like the shard bearers, vying our lord, indignant, if the earth tree, and indeed the very gods, would debase us so, then we are willing to raise the banner of resistance. We at the Volcano Manor, under Lord Rikard, have sworn no rest until it is done. If you follow this heroic path, the lord's visits with our champions are... It cannot come a day to... Are you gonna feed me to a snake man? If you follow the it cannot she's, I think she's gonna feed me to a snake man. You ever played uh, Memento Mori? I gotta say so far it's been quite fun. You can see the devs are super passionate about it. No, I have not. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna assume it's a horror game. I never noticed that her head tracks you. Brave Tarnished, what is your business here? I'm afraid this is not a guest room. What's that peculiar look upon your face? I Goodness, love her. Am I still a serpent? Oh, how dreadful. How dreadful indeed. Oh, You're beautiful. You're perfect. I ought to be thanking you for treating me as usual, despite this appearance. Brave tarnished. This is my true form. I my love her so much. Is Zarias. Please forgive the deception. Look at her Please smile. Understand. Look at her big old smile. This duplicity is my own doing. Lady Tanith speaks no falsehoods. And the volcano manor is just as it seems. Lady Ta I am told I was born by the grace that my mother cherishes this form. I, I am proud of what I am. You should be. The people are cruel. You're cute as fuck. If they saw my true form, they would And so I but you are not like them. My serpent were secrets. Now I share the secrets. Please keep them safe. My serpent were secrets. Now I share this. Please keep them safe. Uh, yes. The reason is because she's a scout. And so, if she can draw enemies to her, that makes it so that other people can get around her. Like, her- the people who she's with are more- better equipped. Does she have snoobs? Snake boobs? No. No snook for you guys. Yeah, we're gonna go kill your dad now. I hope you're okay with that. Yep, 
I fucking thought so. So, I need to go to the city of gold. And I really don't want to. So, we can either march right in, or I think that if we go this way, we go into the back entrance and fight the dragon guy. I think we want to go fight the dragon guy. Ronnie, I have to tell you so Yeah, exactly. Uh, speaking of which, what is the next step in Ronnie's quest? I think I... Let, let's go check in with Ronnie now that we've gone and done. Uh... The thing in the Eternal City. I think I need to go talk to her. Before I go any further. Because a lot of shit changes once you get to Shifting Sandland over here. Wife, are you awake? Ah, it was thee. Not even in my slumber I sensed it. In my thanks. Finally, all the pieces Wife? are in place. Soon must I begin my journey. Upon the dark path only I may tread. Yeah? Ah, but be. <laughs> my thanks for thy sterling efforts. A strange gift, perhaps. But a rare sort such as thee would welcome it, I'm sure. I am certain now. Literally anything. You could spit on me and I'd say thank you. I must thank Torrent, too, for his part. You may leave now. It was but brief. But thou gavest me fine service. I can give you better service. What is it? I, too, am to depart. What is it? I, too... to a talisman or no, no I know what that does I need that for a very specific place give me a sec while I look up Ronnie's quest links I don't remember all this shit I have to do fuck you PC gamer I trust the Fextra Life wiki more Hidden treasure Nocron, already did that. Kill Verdun, yeah, did that. Release it, give Ronnie the finger slate, okay. Which effectively locks you out of the further actions. Quest link, don't care, Celibus is a bitch. Statue. Blah, 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 blah. Upon arriving at the Divine Tower of Lyernia, you will be able to do a curse mark of death. Okay, where's the Divine Tower of Lyernia? I mean, it's obviously in Lyernia. Oh, okay, that's. Right here, this place. Cool, that's where we're going. Fuck progressing the main story. I'm getting married. That's my... That's my prerogative. <laughs> How do I get into this place? Oh, I need to be... Got it. Gotta go down this way. Don't you know Maidens Me, Tig? I know what I'm about. Okay. I see where we're going. 
Look how Ronnie's ending, which is the most complicated, has the highest completion rate. Hey, look. They, they added proper, like, Souls waifus into this game. Normally you get the one. Normally they give you, like, one, maybe two, like, waifus that you can, like, latch onto in Souls games. And it's normally, like, the Fire Keeper or the Maiden in Black or... Did I already get this one? No, I didn't. Or, like... Angri from Astora, who then you murder for her quest line, because that's what you do to people you love. Uh, this one gave you, like, you have your Firekeeper, which is just, uh, Melina, ow. But then, like, you can just act, they actually just let you get married and it not end in death. Lucatiel, Lucatiel's awesome. Lucatiel's fucking awesome. That's that character is so cool. I I want. I wish I liked Dark Souls 2 for its gameplay, so I would actually play and like be around Lucatiel. Is this the 12 a.m. Crocs giveaway? Yes. Be sure to enter your. Uh, information into the uh channel points link hashtag crocs giveaway 2023 and yeah we should be able to help you out wait i remember this don't I fight a piece of shit here? Don't you hit me. If you hit me, you're stupid. That's still the best thing they add into these Souls games, is being able to roll through everything. Books? Fuck them. Magic is for sinners. If you use magic, you're going to hell and we're going to kill you. On the mirror. Dark Souls 2 has a lot of waifus, doesn't it? Look at, those, look at these little shits over here. Why would you remove my aggro? Don't hit me. You hit me, it means you have a small brain. Yeah, this place is, uh, not fun. If memory serves, this place sucks ass. But it's required to get my wife. I'm only human after all. Where, where's your, where's your blue man group? What the, what the fuck?
I not have great arrows? What? What? Do I have great arrows? What the fuck? Oh, here we go. On, bitch. Ow. <laughs> Sorry, we're, we're using Eric's summer form real quick. Because I, I, I think that you actually have to use range to kill this fucker. I realize you're a preserver, but come on, man. I mean, realistically, that bow is just another axe, so it's okay. I could have just smacked him in his stupid face. You know what? That's fine. Bows don't get very much use, and Eric would have probably used a bow to do anyway, realistically, because he's been spiking. So, I'm okay with it. I'm going to allow it. And it was a great bow, so it was an Oonga Boonga bow. down. That's true. Andre is in all of the games and he is the peak Souls waifu. And you know what? Now that I think about it, Dark Souls 3 actually had a decent amount of waifus too. There was the girl who, uh, you could save, and she would uh, become like a secondary firekeeper for you if you did her quest line. And I gotta say, that was one of the more rewarding quest lines I've done in a Souls game. It was fun. You, you just had to give her all of like the non-corrupted prayer books. Giant enemy rats. Uh, okay. That's a lot of rats. That's that's some that's a massive rat. Mr. Bombastic. Yeah, well, yeah, she was a priestess who had come to uh, whatever the land of Dark Souls is to become a firekeeper. But then she got lost or something, and it just didn't work out. She's cool. That I mean, that quest line is really, really fun. Dark Souls 3 has a lot of, like, fun side quest stuff that you can do. I make it a point to actively do a uh, sequel of Katarina's questline every single time that I, that I play that game. 
it's legitimately just worth it. How do I do this? Seagwards is my favorite quest as well. It's it's just mwah. Shit's perfect. I don't remember what I need to do for this. I know that needs to come down. Well, I, I need to turn the place upside down, but do I, I thought I did that up here. Do I don't do I do I don't do that up here? <laughs> You do it at the start? God fucking damn it. You know what? Son of a bitch. You know what though? Okay, we, we got the thing. We got the uh, the the prize at the end that I'm never gonna use because I'm not a caster because magic is for sinners. All right, Eric, put the thing on the thing and fuck this whole thing up. Look at his hairy ass arms. Eric, you don't know what you've done, man. Oh, good night. Thanks for hanging out. I think I die if I go down there. Did I fuck myself over? Try da- No shit. Okay. Oh god. You say there's side bits, but this looks a little fishy, so I think- Okay, I go this way. Oh, hands. Stop it, stop it, stop it. I'm gonna shove this thing up your ass broadside. I'm suddenly remembering why I hate this area. I like had a trauma flashback to when I first cleared this area for the Verani quest. Oh, you. You. Stop. Because he's a cunt and he has ads. Because he's a little bitch who can't fight his own fights. And I don't think I can. I don't think I get to summon uh, my own Eric for that fight, do I? I forgot that these were here, and I about died for it. Or at least took some extra. He lives. Hand that lived come to die. Okay, let's go. Okay. 
I'm sorry about your stream quality. I can't really do much for you on my end. How are you still alive? whole thing up, guy. I'm gonna need you to back the fuck out of this pool. Oh, so now you're just not gonna charge your shit. You're that much of a pussy, huh? Fight me. So why you get bullied to school? Got. Where are you? You're down there, you son of a bitch. I'm going to skin you, and then I'm going to salt your wounds. Why magic is the weapon of the sinner? Shall pay and burn in the lake of fire for eternity, caster. Anyway, how are you guys doing? If he saw, I thought he just summoned again. I was about to go ballistic. Thankfully, it's just some. Like level two, it's a level two knight that you farm in Final Fantasy. Hole ahead, yet yeah, no shit. Thank you, guy. And I don't believe that he comes back. Okay. Well, that was stress-inducing. Okay. Now for... Now for fun. Now for all the fun in the world. Balancing myself so I don't die. I thought that was a hat behind me. I thought I was going to die. No. I saw that guy hanging from there, and I had, like, flashbacks to Dark Souls 3. It's like, some dude is gonna crawl up here and kick my ass. And just, like, he's not even gonna attack me, he's just gonna push me. Okay. Yo! Down. 
My friend played Dark Souls 3 and he said it's just Bondo with Solaire. Any input on the care on that character? If you're if he's playing Dark Souls 3 and says Solaire is it says Bondo, then he's not playing Dark Souls 3. Solaire is not in that game, but his armor is. Can I open this? Uh, Solaire as a character, though, is awesome. His armor is in Dark Souls 3, to be fair. Solaire as a character is really cool. He's, uh... He's, like, a literal ray of sunshine in a world of garbage. And he's a constant, like, jolly companion that you can find. He's awesome. We love Solaire. Isn't there a fat man in a diaper I have to kill in this area? I swear there's a fat man in a diaper I have to kill in this area. There he is. How do I have the like a huge fucking axe and no range at the same time? Riddle me that one, fucking Batman. guy. I do. Get me out of here. For very obvious reasons, I'm not looking at chat right now. Come on, get me out of this corner. Get me out of this corner. God damn it. Colossal weapons that look like axes allowed. Depends on what it is. What do you have in mind? You know what? I have these. You know what else I have? I have shit I can put into my flask. Halberds are a no. I mean, I think I'm, I think I'm like obligated to stick with the thing I've got right now. I should honestly do this. I'm not using my thing there. 
Nix physique. Poise, charged attacks, eliminates all FP consumption. I need this one, that's better. Hydration, you got it. Good shit. Can I even apply poison to this? I didn't think so. I didn't think that you could put... You were not able to in another game, so I did figure you wouldn't be able to in this game either. I technically don't need to fight this guy. I can just, like, run away from him if I want to. I thought I fucked it up, but I was fine. That, there's the fuck up. Back off. I don't know if I can actually stun this guy. Ow. Done, but like, po not poise break. There, there's a word for it. Alright, back up, back up. Jesus, okay. Fat man got moves. you, dude. Okay. Okay. I need to heal. I need to not be doing what I'm doing right now. I should just heal. <sighs> There's no wind-up on that that fucks me up. die here. Oh, I'm out of juice. God damn it. I thought I dodged too late. No! You fucker with the no wind-up fucking bullshit. Like, literally, the, the, there's... <sighs> See, stuff like that in these games is what pisses me off. Because there is nothing you can do. Like, there's no, there's no frames that you can predict what he's going to do. He just does it. And for pretty much every other, like, attack that every character has, it's semi-predictable, because you can be like, yeah, he always, like, he has the wind-up that he's going to do. And he just doesn't. It's just like, yeah, I'm just gonna do this now, and you gotta deal with it. And twice? Nope. There it is. Yeah, 
Well, yeah, the Godskin Apostles are a pain in the dick. They're just the Godskin guys in general. Like, look, like that. Double bounce. It didn't hurt, it didn't hit me, but like... Really? I'm gonna go I'm gonna get out of bounds right here. That would have really pissed me off. Okay. Oh, through the wall. Okay. I healed too close. That's on me. Yep. Okay. And that didn't hit. That didn't hit. Like, god damn it. There's no predicting it. He just does it. Okay, I was rolling. Just kill me, dude. Fuck you. You the you are literally the worst recurring boss in this entire game. You have so much fucking health. You do bullshit attacks. <sighs> Fuck this guy. Three axes I listed. Uh, I think I'm just going to stick with them. I mean, because this one also visually looks like this. I'm not using a bow. It breaks the oath of the blood axe line. I used it for that one occasion. I probably shouldn't have, but... You know. Classic heal and they hit you with a fucking fireball. Yep, that's okay. Yep, you got a twofer. I just gotta keep my distance. And not fuck up my jump attacks. That would also be great. Yeah, I was rolling for that. didn't connect to the wall that you threw that through. Okay. Fucker.
greedy. I got greedy. I'm gonna fucking probably die for it. On a good run with this too. I was okay, fuck you. I die here. <sighs> Fucking hate this guy. I really do. This is where I mauled. This is where I start molding. Fucking bastard. Duelist Great Axe, Rotten Great Axe, and Axe of Godfrey. Uh, Axe of Godfrey is not happening. You know what, let's try it on the horse. Maybe it'll be easier because I have a horse. Second stage is where I don't think I can use the horse. Yeah, I thought that might happen. Okay. Unavoidable, by the way. Unavoidable, by the way. That, that move is such bullshit. Moves like that in these games are a blight. I'm dead. Okay, he stopped. Sick. Oh, I'm probably just gonna die here anyway. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. It's, it's actually, you can't avoid that. Crazy. Good programming. Eat shit and die, you fat fuck. Burn in hell where you belong, you worthless enemy. Axe of Godfrey is literally... Oh, that one. Uh, I'm going to stick with this. Maybe, maybe I go for Axe of Godfrey after. Just to have the biggest axe, but, you know...
that was awful. I hate those guys. I can't wait to fight an even worse one in, uh... in Volcano Manor, because I'm pretty sure there's another fat one in there. Yeah, yeah, I mean, this one is just stylistically the Blood Axe, so I think I might just stick with it. Okay. Here's Ronnie's original body before she was turned into a Nike. What do I do after this? Curse mark. Uh, this is a Ronnie. Used to be an EG. It will tell you where Ronnie is gone. Mentioning Ronnie. Blah, blah, blah. Carrying a Phil Gray Crest. We have the Merc. Okay. Uh, Rena's Rise. Vanish. Like that. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, we're going to go talk to EG, and then we're going to call the stream. How's that sound? I believe EG is still going to be... Yeah. <laughs> Wood. Oh, there you Have you heard? Lady Rani has departed on her journey. Oh, good. Along the dark path of the Empyrean, from Rena's Rise, as she calls it. Uh huh. It would not have been possible without you. I know. As Lady Rani's war counselor, and moreover, her childhood warden, I express my deepest gratitude. You and only you. Were Lady Rani's true champion. I know. Cause wife. Something. No. All right. Uh, and that's Rena's right. Okay, you know, you know what we're gonna go do. We're gonna go. We're gonna go talk to Celavis's dead ass. Because we we literally killed him in that tower. Ah, I see that you've been working with Lady Rani. Well, I may have some things for you. Wait, what are you doing? Why are you approaching me with that fucking axe? Back the fuck off. I don't think you're alive. I don't think so. Dumbass. Alright. That's where we're gonna stop for now. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you for the uh thank you for the follows, thank you for the resubs, thank you for hanging out for this whole time. I will be back tomorrow with Gotcha Game. So uh yeah, we're going to be uh, doing more stuff tomorrow. For now, guys, uh, keep your chin-ups. Have a great rest of your day. Peace out, yo. Oh!